Is our universe the only one? What if it isn't? We're just one bubble in a cosmic foam? I know, that sounds wild, but here's why serious physicists take it seriously. First, inflation. Right after the Big Bang, space exploded outward insanely fast. Some versions say inflation never fully stops. It ends here. It keeps going there. In places it pinches off new bubble universes. Each bubble has its own physics, that's eternal inflation. Second, quantum mechanics. Many worlds says every quantum coin flip branches reality. There aren't one history, countless parallel histories exist side by side, not touching. Third, string theories landscape, tiny strings vibrating different ways change the laws of nature. Most universes are empty, some are weird, a few are life-friendly like ours. How many universes? Honestly, we don't know. Some models imply numbers so huge they're effectively infinite, but here's the catch. Zero direct evidence. Other universes, if they exist, don't seem to talk to ours. Our best telescopes only see the observable universe, about 46 billion light years in every direction. Light hasn't had time to travel farther. Beyond that horizon, more of our universe, or the start of another bubble. We can't check. Yet. Now. Constellations. Are they other universes? Nope. Constellations are connect the dots pictures we draw from Earth. Orion. Scorpius. The Big Dipper. The stars aren't actually close together, like they just line up from our viewpoint. Officially, there are 88 constellations approved by the IAU. They cover the whole sky like a map, one universe or many. The multiverse could explain why our universe's numbers seem just right. Until a theory makes a testable prediction. Until we see a signal, a scar in the CMB from a bubble collision, it stays a maybe. Even not knowing is powerful. It pushes us to ask sharper questions, build better instruments, look deeper. Every time we look deeper, the universe, maybe the multiverse, gets a little less mysterious. So, are we alone as a universe? For now, that's the best cliffhanger in science.